Well, good morning. Welcome to another video. So today I'm going to Welford Pools Nature Reserve um, to see if I can get the um, Great Crested Grebes doing their courtship dance. Now you can see this event from sort of like February time all the way through the spring. Um, I've not been lucky enough to actually see it myself, so which is why I'm going out there today. Left it a little bit late. Um, it's about quarter to quarter to midday um, today, so it's about quarter to twelve. And um, left it a little bit late. I had to run some chores this morning with my wife. So hopefully, my only thing is, is I might not be able to get a parking space when I get there because there's only enough parking for twelve cars. And it does get busy, so I've got a chance to be luck. I'm going to go out there anyway and see what we can do. And with that, I'll see you later. So I've arrived at Welford Pools Nature Reserve. Um, I actually got a parking space. I went in here, there was literally one other car in there. Normally, this time of day, no matter what time of year it is, the car parks round. So today must be an off day. I wonder if that's an omen. Anyway, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to a lake where I've uh, seen the Great Crested Grebe on a Great Crested Grebe on a previous visit. Um, I'm not saying there's going to be any there, and in fact, this video might not have any in. So to see a Great Crested Grebe and, and to actually is one thing, but to actually record its. Um, courtship dance is another because it doesn't last long and you've got to be on you've got to be have your wits about you to do it but I'm gonna I'm walking to a lake where I know where there might be some so I say I've seen them there before and we just have to uh, take it how it, can, how, how it goes today but I've got my 100 to 400 with the, the uh, 1.4 teleconverter today I've got my new tripod with the gimbal head it's actually in its case here and that's about it so anyway I'm gonna crack on and get to my spot and I'll bring you back when I'm there and I'm set up and we're having a look see you later so I've got two uh, great crested greaves just in front of me I'll quickly uh, set up my tripod I'm gonna put the spikes on that. I'll put the spikes on it. Hang on a minute, I'll put it down on the floor. There we go. I'll put the spikes on it. I'm gonna have it up too high. There we go. Just dig it in. And I've got my indoor head in my bag. Just here. So I'll quickly uh, get all this on get the camera on see what we can see what we can do moved myself around this uh, lake and an Egyptian goose flew in not kidding <laughs> how lucky was that I managed to get it on video not very good video 
I, I took a couple of photos as well. Not stunning photos, but I took a couple of photos. And I can't see it now. It's gone, I think it's gone on the bank somewhere. It just landed right in front of me, just over here. And it perched on the corner of that island there. And sat there for a while, and then it came in the water and swam right past me. So I managed to get some video of it and um, a picture. An Egyptian goose, wow. Don't know where he's gone now. feet from the car and I decided to come to a blind that I know it's a screen it's a wicker screen so I decided to come here and I'm glad I did because I've got a couple of uh, great crested greaves uh, building their floating nest and they have done the courtship dance as well but I didn't bloody get it on film <laughs> oh dear never mind but they're building up the nest quite slowly. You've seen you've seen the video. You've probably already seen the video. And they keep diving down, bringing up weeds from the bottom, and just building the nest up, building the nest up, building the nest up. And then one of them will sit on it to make sure that it's nice and sturdy. And if it's if it starts to sink, which it still is, and they just go back and they just keep building it up, building it up. So she sat on it again. Look. What happened earlier was one of them was sat on there, and the other one came along and went on top of her. And then. They both got off and they went over about five feet to, to the right and then they started doing the courtship dance again. Only lasted five seconds, literally five seconds. And then they came back and they're still gathering all their, all the weeds and reeds and stuff to build up on their nest. Absolutely pleased the plunger came here. I've already rung the wife, I told her I'll be home. <laughs> That's what happens when you deviate. I'm going to stay here for a little bit longer and then I'll start making tracks home. I think I've got enough footage here to be honest. 
I just want to see if they do that courtship dance again so I can at least get it on film, but I don't think I will, to be honest. Anyway, I'll say thank you for watching, and I'll see you on the next video.